Take a little inside move on him, Willie. Go on, Willie. Take a little inside move on him, please. I got our right. 94 sprint. Willie's going to make a little move. You come on the football. Tell that ball back. Mark what to put the in on the ground. Willie's going to make a little move. Come on with it. If you have to get him outside. So tell Larry now. Go, George. Larry, go, go, hey. Go, 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 go. Tell the fullback to put the end on the ground. That's the key to making the play work. It was an option sprint, with Amundsen either running or throwing to Willie Jones. It was meant to go wide, where Iowa State had been successful all night. But two Georgia Tech defenders spoiled the plot. Number 45, Tim Macy, and number 90, the end who was supposed to be on the ground, Bo Bruce. Amundsen had no room to run, and his receivers were covered. Georgia Tech had won by a single point, one of the wildest games in football history, a 31 to 30 upset of Iowa State. For the national television audience and the capacity throng at Memphis Stadium, it was college football at its best, considered by experts the most exciting bowl game of the season.